fire sale. Looks like we already got a bunch of people online and we may have some other people join us later, but we're really, really excited. This is our second fire sale of this week. So we're super excited. Just a reminder, next week we will not be doing any fire sales because we will be at the ASD Market Week in Las Vegas. We'll be streaming live from there, so you definitely want to tune in. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. Oops, that's really loud. I was listening to something really that was really quiet. Here. Oh, good. Did you get it? Yeah, let me shut the volume off. I got to keep it on. Hello, everybody. Go ahead and... Uh, all right. Yeah, we're expecting some snow and ice here too. Just an inch of snow and then uh, about a roughly around an inch of ice itself. So that's what we're expecting. I see several of you are commenting mm -hmm. about the weather. Hopefully that doesn't cause a problem. It's supposed to hit right about now. Yes. Awesome. So it seems like every time we have a live fire <laughs> sale, we've got the kids home from school and ice and snow and everything. Yep. So anyway, we like the extra help and I know you guys like to see us. Um, We do have one helper today during the fire sale. Um, Lexi is here to be the runner. Look, she's like bigger than me. Now. I think she's taller than <laughs> yeah, me. Yeah, she is taller than me now. <laughs> I have lifts and <laughs> <laughs> so um, anyway, she is taller than me. But um, any super chats that you do today will go directly to her. She'll get 100% of the cashola. That's what happened to Faith. Lexi heard about it and said, hey, you know, I'll be willing to help on the fire cell. But no, she is a great help. Um, and she actually cooked us dinner last night. Chicken and rice, seasoning on it was amazing. Anyway, all right, so we're going to go ahead and go over the rules and let you know how you participate in a live fire sale. Make sure you're in live chat, not top chat. Live chat, not top chat. That is the way in which we um, do all of the comments that we have them all come in. All right, to buy, it's going to type sold, then the number. Be the first one. I'll announce your name or Paul will announce your name. Payment must be made within 72 hours via an invoice from hookedonpicking.com. Sent by today or tomorrow evening we always say give us a couple days because if some kind of technical um hiccup happens that gives us some leeway check your spam folder we've had a lot of people that um i had a, a buyer last week that for whatever reason couldn't get his invoice and then he just simply sent me a new email and was able to get it and so just let me know if you don't get it pay with a and, secure credit and, card checkout andrew elder donated ten dollars awesome there you go. thank you very much um andrew elder is a very very uh faithful viewer of ours um hundred dollars free shipping so if you buy over a hundred dollars and you live in the lower 48 of the united states you will get free shipping on your order if you're a new buyer listen up new buyers you can participate today but there's no way for me to access your info unless you send me an email with your address and your youtube name if it's different from your regular name to hookedonpicking.com under the contact me section or you can send it directly to me at hookedonpicking at gmail.com. All right, if you lag at any time, you can exit and re-enter, and that should put you back to real live. Make sure you're in live chat, and then all shipping will be combined on today's fire sale, and so you'll have all combined shipping. We do do international shipping as well, so if you are international, you can purchase on today's fire sale as well. All right, let's get this party started. All right, number one. Number one is our Big Ben clock, wind-up clock. Big Ben wind-up clock, only five bucks is all we're asking. Yeah, this is actually a baby. Ben right yeah. here but it's the same kind of style there yeah. made in the USA pretty little clock it's got the metal it's not plastic and hey uh Cynthia donated five dollars thank awesome. you Cynthia thank you Cynthia so Lexi's racking up the dough already <laughs> she's got a car to save for that's yep. what she needs the dough for it does have as you see here it's got some paint rubbing there and there most of these do with age of course um but uh, I think it, oh, it's older. Uh, Denise, um, is that uh, Tho Mason or Thompson? Tom Thomason. Thomason. There we go. We got it. Number one is gone. Denise got it. All right, perfect. Got you down, Denise. On All right, number, number two, two is our wooden pulley. This is a vintage woven pulley with beautiful cast iron curves on it. Um, it is, uh, it says N E Y manufacturing company and so it's got a really cool i guess the wooden ones are the more popular ones and that one actually is a free spinning wheel so it yeah. does actually free spin old wood barn pulley yep and really then, cool yep really cool vintage piece 25 dollars. we have a lot of our auction finds at the beginning we, we will move into some of our new items some of our pet items we've got goodies and yummies we've got some books we've got some candy we got some health and beauty we got some makeup so make sure you stay tuned for all of the fun things we have 67 Seven things for sale. I, think I believe I put so. Sixty-eight on the on the thumbnail, but we have sixty-seven. All right, so number two, twenty-five dollars for the wooden barn pulley. 
with the beautiful cast iron curves on that um, uh, barn pulley. So 25 bucks on that. $25. All right, here's a set of what uh, we're going to call bowling bookends. Whether they're just decorative pieces or bowling bookends, um, we'll go ahead and show you those. They are, you're going to buy the set for $20. The set for $20. I don't know if I put something behind it. Yeah, it's clear. You know, there. it's glass. Can you see it a little better that way? Uh, maybe not a little much. bit there. Yeah, not too bad. Okay, we can put a box behind it. And that might see help. my hand there. Kind of cool. Here we go. That I think they're more of a vintage... That way you can see the picture. Vintage bowler, because he's, well, I don't know, just looks vintage to me. Can you see it better with the darker background? A little bit, a uh, little the, bit. The picture is the same on both of the pieces, Yep. and they're identical. There's no chips or cracks in the glass. Yep. Really neat. $20 for the set. $20 for the set. Mm -hmm. So uh, we went back and forth. Are these bookends? Were Are they, they a part of pieces? something or just Are decorative they pieces? Landscaping stone. I even wondered if they were like given out to someone if they, uh, you know, they won a bowling competition or something like that. But there's like no year on it or anything like that. Just really kind of cool looking. It would be good to surmise that they're bookends because they're identical and they're two of them. Yeah. Yep. So. Yeah. Someone says, yeah, it looks like something you would put on a trophy. Yeah, that's yeah. what I was kind of thinking too. But boy, it's got a lot of weight to it. Trophy mm -hmm. plaques, maybe? Yeah, maybe. maybe. I don't know. But uh, we got two of them. Yep. There you go. Really cool For all you bowling. bowlers out there. Bookends. So there they are. $20 for number three. All right. Then we're going to go to the Harvest Wall Art. Harvest Wall Art. Really cool pieces. You're buying the set. So you're going to get both of them for $15. So you got your cool kind of, what is that, like a butter churn? And then you got your like corn husker grinder, corn grinder. Yeah, I think this is like an apple press for apple cider, maybe. Yeah. We, aren't these apples? Yeah, they look like apples. And then this, these are metal, by the way. They are not plastic. They are yeah. cast iron. So, which is kind of neat here. Yeah. And I'm trying to see what they're made by. Uh, Homco, 1978 or 1976, 1978. So, got some age to it. Yep. Not in, not incredibly old. I think it would be kind of considered well, vintage. Forty three years old. Yeah, not bad at all. And then uh, really good shape though. Yeah. These were other auction finds there. I just love the color; is so vibrant. It does so, pop. Yeah, does pop well. Number four, fifteen dollars for the set. Yeah, that color on cast iron does does hold up well like that. All right. All right. Another one of our vintage finds. Now, this is one of the coolest finds I think we have. This is a vintage kind of 1950s style fire truck. It's got your one little red light here. It does come with a fire hydrant that, look, attaches to your garden spigot. Roxanne Majeski, sold number four. Okay, awesome. Got you down, Roxanne. Sorry, Michelle. I only had one of those there. On this side over here, we do have does come with the ladder. This is one of the original ladders that came with it. I'm sure it came with two, but I only have one. But this is a big deal that it came with actually this little this little fire hydrant that you can actually put into the uh, garden, hose. garden hose and it actually works. Now there is apparently a hose that was supposed to attach to here that would come to, yeah, this, you gotta flip right? it around, would go into this right here. And then this would actually spray. Yeah, then the top would spray. But I think this hose might need a little bit of TLC yeah, or replacing. It's, it, this is an older hose, of course. It, it is equipped with it, but we don't have the hose that goes from here to here. Most of the time, those are tubing. gone Yeah. from what uh, somebody told me. But uh, very expensive things on YouTube, for, yes. or not YouTube, but on eBay. So when you look these up, these are around the $200 mark. So this one, we're actually only charging $100, yep. which means whatever else you buy on here is automatically free shipping. Right. Because once you hit that $100 mark, if you're in the United States, you're going to get that free shipping. So you're not even going to have to pay shipping on any of your items if you purchase this today, because you'll be over the $100. Now... Everything in the sale, if you equal over $100, too. So if you buy some of our other, you know, more expensive trucks, that'll get you to the closer to right. the $100 mark as well. And this is 1957. Mm -hmm. 1957, it's pressed steel. We believe it's Tonka. Um, not 100% certain on the Tonka, but when I was looking them up on eBay. They're identical to all the, the Tonka yeah, trucks. It was. it looked exactly like that, but really sharp. Sharp truck. Yep. Cool looking fire truck. All right. Okay. Are you ready? Yep. 
All number right. Number six. Number six is a glass dug bowl. Uh, it's got a really cool kind of deep bowl there. It's clear glass. And it's it got a pretty, pretty substantial size, but you could use it for a planter or a bowl because it's kind of deep there. It goes probably about three inches deep there. So number six is a clear glass double. I think that would look really cool if you put some sort of a colored candy yep. in there. Tony Corcoran or, sold number six. All right. It is gone. All right, perfect. Here's another old truck. Very, I, I wouldn't call this vintage. I'd call it an antique truck. Definitely the body style. It says it is the automatic loading. We have it at $60 there and um, got definite some age. I'm thinking from when I was looking them up, they look like either right about the time of World War II or if not uh, just either a few years after or a few years before. So you're looking at probably an early 40s truck, um, maybe late 30s truck but definitely got some age to it. But the cool thing about it is it still has the decal that looks really sharp on it. And a lot of these you just don't see. They look like they've almost been sandblasted or left out in the rain and rusted real ugly nasty. But this one's still got a really cool looking shape. Uh, is it heavy? Uh, no, this one isn't really that heavy at all. Probably I'm going to take a wild stab at it. Maybe a two pound truck here. You know, it's, it's made solid, but as you can see, it's more of a thinner uh, steel, aluminum, whatever this was made out of. Not bad at all. Uh, so, Sue, yes, I did re receive your email. I just haven't gotten a chance to respond yet. Sorry about that. So, looks really slick. Kind of has that space age back to it and it front does. to it. You know, this, and the this wheels here. work. Yep, it rolls. Really a nice truck. I wonder the stories that truck could tell. Oh, yeah. All right. There so you go. That one is number seven. Number seven for 60? Yep. And All then right. for something a, completely different. Okay. So this is a mantle clock for $45. A mantle clock for $45. And um, this one, actually, we were setting up for the fire sale last night, and it chimed at us. Yeah. <laughs> so it's clearly working. It yep. started chiming. The only thing I would say is that this glass face... Um, is not fitting as tight. The hinge needs the to be, hinge needs to be uh, a little worked on a little bit there. You know, and uh, but it does have, if we turn it around, it does come with the key. Yep. And all the innards on the inside. And if you look at this here too, look how they've got. I've never seen one, and That's it might just be my lack of mantle clock, but I've seen a lot at auctions. And look, it's got the groove there and there. In the pendulum. You can hear it. You hear it? <laughs> so it's 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 free flowing or what do you call it? Nothing's locked up in it. Free moving. Free moving. It's a cathedral uh sound. I think it was a tempora number six. I think yeah. that's the song or whatever. A cathedral, what is it? Cathedral gong movement. So really pretty. Forty five dollars is what we're asking for on that there. Mm-hmm. And mainly we we did a fairly lower price because we usually sell these closer to 70 or 80 yep. uh, just because it does need a little bit of TLC on that front glass yep. piece. But having the key is huge. This yeah. is New Haven, yeah. and it's made in the USA. Yep. You can see that there it says New Haven there, right down there, made in the USA. Nice little mantle clock. Yep. <laughs> so that was Lexi sneezing, everybody. <laughs> Uh, just so that some of you know, we now have 222 people on. Well, that was an easy number to read. Lexi is helping us today, so all Super Chats do go directly to Lexi. She's helping to bring things to the... Uh, there she is. <laughs> the, the kids are out of school because of uh, snow day, so that yep. kind of worked out for us. All right, so we have the mantle clock at $45 still available, the New Haven mantle clock. Number nine is a really cool remote control tech tractor. It's got the bucket on the front and then the backhoe on the back. Um, it's got the little remote. Um, the wire does, it just looks like the wire is just the casing has issues. I don't see any chewing or breaking in the actual wire. You open this up and you put your batteries in. And, there's and no the corrosion. battery, the, yeah, that looks beautiful That inside. still has like the battery direction thing in right. it. So I'm not sure if it was ever used. It might have just been a display piece. Right. But um, really cool piece, an old school remote control uh, Ford 
uh, 4,000 industrial tractor. Yep. So this one is $80. And remember, if you hit that $100 mark, you're going to get free shipping. Oh, look, he's extending the, uh, the that, claw there. That's just the fun, isn't it? That is fun. That is fun, isn't it? It's Pull a lot of fun. That is cool. Mm-hmm. We're just playing with toys here. Yep, that's what we do. We We're just having play a good with toys. Time. <laughs> so hard to find. I could only find two of these on eBay at yep. all. They did not make many of these in, and I think uh, the in those years. This one was ninety dollars, mm. so we priced ours for eighty. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so. Faith Hook says hello from Mama Hooks and Faith. They're watching in the uh, over at the house. Yep. Yep. Absolutely. So number nine is eighty dollars. Awesome. Moving on. All right, number ten. Number ten is a really cool Emerson radio. Very turn, very mid-century style there, kind of the 50s style Emerson radio. Um, it does uh, have the regular uh, pronged plug-in stuff. Uh, looks like somebody did rewire it, and so the Emerson yep. radio. The wire, you're going to have to check it out a little bit there. But... We did not plug it in. Yep. Uh, the, we do know that it is missing a knob, which was which is why the uh, price there. is much lower. So $40 on the vintage Emerson radio. Even if you never use this, just the look of it is really cool. Yeah, it does have a cool look. Yeah. Stick that on a bookshelf. But the uh, all the knobs do turn freely. Yep. So you can even The knob change. that's missing is, I believe, it's the volume knob. Yeah. So look, even if you wanted to tune it and stuff, that all yeah. still works good. It's a Philco. I think I got the model number down. Somebody wanted the model number. Is model 50-925. Yep. $40. Number 10. Yep. We're going to get into some of our new stuff here for a little while, and then we will bring back some of the vintage auction finds here in a bit. All right, so we have the extra small dog bundle. So it comes with a dog sweater um, and a dog little outfit and a dog chew toy. It says squeeze me. Does it make noise? I don't know what it does. It says squeeze me. I know. It's a dog toy. Oh, maybe just because it's flexible. Could be. All right. So it is... Uh, For extra small. Extra small dog. Extra small dog. Or cat. Or cat. I guess, yeah, See, I guess look, a cat. A yeah. cat on yeah. that one. Put your cat in a sweater. Have a good time. Yep. So, so. it's number 11. It is so Lauren T. Lauren T. Soul number 11. Okay, great. That's a new name. Yep. I haven't noticed Lauren T. before. All right. If we... If I, uh, Lauren T. I have some Laurens that buy on the Hooked on Pickin' store, so let me know exactly who you are by sending me an email and saying, hey, I bought some stuff on the fire sale and I was Lauren T. We're here at icing now. It is icing outside. Boy, they said it would start at noon. They were they were, they were close. Yeah. That's not bad all at right, all. Number twelve. Here's another extra small bundle. It's a Target bundle. So if you would like your dog to look like a Target employee, then here you go. We have two sets of these that are identical. So you have a Target uniform. Look at the picture. I think that's hilarious. And then we have a cool extra small. Um, uh, sweater and both of these bundles are the same. We have two of them at ten dollars each. Two of them at ten dollars yep. each. So, Target uh, uniform and the cool sweater there, number twelve, extra small for a cat or a dog. So, I don't know if it puts these it. are so cute. Yeah, they, they are, are really really cute. Like I just want. Oh, I would love to see <laughs> a picture of their pet in the Target Somebody Target sent uniform. us pictures of their cat yes, or dog, did. didn't they? Yep, someone sent me a picture of their cat. It was super cute. That was cool. Thank yeah. you for doing that, too. That's really, really nice of you to do that. Yep. So, okay, uh, Nicole uh, uh, Dickinson. Perfect. Soul number 12. Nicole Dickinson, soul number 12. All right, and then... And let's roll Tina, sold number 12. All right. All right. So we've got both of those sold, number 12, both of those sold. Then we have number 13. Number 13, we have four of these available at $5 a piece. Four of these available at $5 a piece. We unboxed these yesterday, I think. Yep, we did unbox them yesterday. This is a makeup brush set. We have four makeup brushes. does come with a pouch and everything to hold everything in. Are you ready? Yep. Roxanne Majewski, sold number 13. Okay. Jenny's Everything, sold number 13. Jenny's Everything? Oh, wait. How did she say to pronounce it? Like, I dream of Jeannie. Yeah. Jeannie's Everything? Yeah. Grandpa, Grandpa Hook showed up. Chuck Hooks is in the back there. Yeah, he is. 
Uh, Tony Corcoran, sold number 13. You get genies everything. I did. And then Ronald I got Brown. Ronald Brown, sold number 13. And that's all I had, right? Yep. Okay. It. All right. Then we have another dog bundle. Really fun. Number 14. This is for a small dog. A small size dog. Number 14, $15. Number 14, you get two nice, really fun sweaters for your dogs, and then a dog toy. A dog toy, which is, I think, Santa Claus and Mrs. Claus inside the uh, the village house. So Your see, dog can destroy said, Santa Claus. We we're just playing with toys here and hooked on picking. That's what we do. Uh, we're not on 15. We're on number 14, number Lauren. Number 14, it's $15. There you go. Yep. Uh, Diana Flanagan sold number 14. Got you down, Diana. All right. Then go ahead and move on. We got the next one ready. Next let's one's ready. On it. Uh, let's see. See the beauty. You might be a little behind because I haven't seen anybody bid too early or anything right now. Yep. If you feel like you're lagging at any time, you can go ahead and just leave the stream and re-enter. Make sure you're in live chat as well because then it puts it everything in comments-wise in the order we right. see. Right. Occasionally, your name will so show up before everyone else's, but we pull it right off the live stream. You can re-watch it and see the order. This is a medium dog bundle. Medium dog bundle, $15. You get both outfits and the cool Santa coming down the... Again, your dog can destroy Santa Claus. Destroy Santa Claus. I feel like it's... Sindra Daniels, sold number 15. All right, Sindra Daniels. Got that there, Heather? Yep. All right, moving on. This, uh, I think we're moving up in size as we yes. go here. This is an extra large bundle. Yep. This is a $20 bundle because you get three outfits for your dog. Yep. So there you go. Everybody needs a, a very large wardrobe for your for your dog. Absolutely. Tony Corcoran, sold number 16. All right, Tony's like, I have a big dog. You have a big dog? Now you have a big wardrobe. Yep. And All then, right. uh, anybody remember Lamb Chop? I think it's Lamb Chop, ain't it? My little sister used to watch Lamb Chop. Lamb I have Chop? a sister 10 years younger than me, and she watched Lamb Chops all the time. Sure so, yeah, and yeah. then number five, Lamb Chop toy. Two of them available. They squeak as well. Five bucks. Yep. For you get uh, for, for one, that is. And it is a dog toy. Tony Corcoran sold number 17. I've got one more. Okay. And let's see here. Ronald Brown sold number 17. Got you down. Uh, I need number 18. There we go. Uh, let's see, where's my tag at there? All there right, number go. 18, we have three of these available. They're kind of a tug-of-war dog toy, and so really fun for them to chew on and play with. And number 18, $5, three available for the rope dog toy. Did 13 already sell out? Number 13 is sold out, yes. The yeah, I'm question. out of 13, Nicole. I'm out of 13. Uh, let's see, number 18, Tony Corcoran, sold number 18. Uh, Lynn, I don't think you said sold there. You just said 18. Ronald Brown sold number 18. And I got one more. I got Sher Sherry Mitchell sold number 18. A lot of new people on today. That's awesome, guys. All right, if you've never bought on the fire sale, please make sure that you give me your contact info or let me know. Even if you've bought on Hooked on Pickin', I need to make sure that I match you with the customer information I have. So just send me an email and say, hey, I bought some stuff on the fire sale today. All right, here's a really good deal. For five bucks, you get all four of these. They are two each, so you're going to get eight total containers. Number 19, we have three sets of these. I think they were used for kind of Christmas cookies or whatever, but you can never have too many containers in your house. Yep. And eight containers for five is awesome. Tony Corcoran stole number 19. I've got two more sets of these. Okay. Uh, and then, uh, what is it? I Dream of Genie. Genie's everything. So number 19 times two, and I'm out. I got a lot of people that wanted them. Sorry, we only had three. I could have sold like 30 more. That's when we wish we had 30. All right, this is a Phillips Norelco Shaver 7100 razor. We did open the box to inspect it just because the box had been opened, but everything is brand new. It is unused. Everything is still actually bound up just like if it was brand new. So whatever happened, they opened it and decided, I'll never use this, and they yep. returned it or whatever. Well, I can, I I can open it, it too. It was opened in the store. So this was fifty dollars for the Phillips. Oop, never mind, it's gone. Okay. Uh, L Media Step. Okay, fifty dollars for the razor. L Media Step, sold number twenty. Okay. Got that there. Uh, Nicole, we were past number nineteen. Or is number nineteen still available? No, nineteen is gone. 
So okay. sometimes uh, your uh, video can get a little bit delayed. Vivian Hooks is on. Awesome. Hello, Hooks. It's our cousin. I, I, we're we're it's gotta be. She's a cousin somehow. All right. So thank you so much. We have got to... Oh, I wish I had the story about the scrunchies. There's lots of stories about the scrunchies there, now. If you have not watched our last video when we unboxed these scrunchies, number 21, $15 for all three of these sets of scrunchies. If you have not watched the video... Read the comments. We started talking about a, a scrunchie. It's sold. Ronald world. Brown sold number twenty one. And, and uh, it's you get the really you get fun. all three for fifteen, Ronald. Yep. Yeah, you need to read the comments of that video. Well, that was yesterday's number twenty two. The duster refills two pack five dollars for both of them. So this is even great. Uh, even if you don't have the like the wand that it goes on, you stick it on your hand and you can just dust things. This thing like sucks up all the dust on every counter or surface. So, you know, feel free to go ahead and get both of those. Number 22, five bucks is all we're asking for the Duster Refills 2-pack. If uh, if you're bald, it could go as a toupee also. That's Tony good. Corcoran, sold number 22. Okay. And we got a candle. Yep, this is a blue, blue glade candle. Blue glade candle. It is aqua um, waves. You can smell a wave. Smell an aqua wave. A blue wave. A blue aqua wave. It smells like salt water and fun. Uh, Genie's everything. Yeah, perfect. We got it right. Soul number 23. We finally know how to pronounce it. Patricia Watt says, need to check. I think I had number 21. Okay, All right, let's we're see. Go let's back go back to 21. Check. 21, 21, 21. I have Ronald Brown first Ron at 21. Yeah, we've got Ronald Brown, then we have Roxanne Majeski, then we have Patricia Watts. So yes. Yep, you were did you were just two down. Just two down. Close. Yep, yep close. Okay, 24. This is a lip balm set. It comes with a lip scrub, a lip balm, and a lip gloss. So kind of like if you ever done the Mary Kay um satin lips, it's very Ooh. similar to that. Yeah, they're it's not all kind trying of to come out of the, its package, it's trying to. Yeah, there you go. Number 24, $7.50 for that set. So, uh, are, Ronald, know. you got to say sold, then the number. Yep, yeah, sold, then the number. I'm on number 24, Roxanne. Number 24. Let's see. Who's it going to be? Ronald Brown, sold number 24. Got you down, Ronald Brown. He's gone. All right, then we have Sarah B. Cream. Uh, $10 for this big container of Sarah... S Cerevive. Cerevive Cerevive Moisturing Cream. Yep. Ten dollars for this big container. Yep. Those are like twenty dollars. I store. know. That's crazy. That's at Target. Yeah. Tony Corcoran sold number twenty-five. Okay. Got you down, Tony. All right. This is a cool um, nail manicure set. It actually comes with this little thing on top. Is one of those dryers for the nail gel, and so you stick your finger in there, and it actually dries the nails. But if you flip it over on the back, it shows you everything that comes with it, just like that. So there's a whole manicure set in there. Fifteen dollars for the nail manicure set. Fifteen dollars. Uh, Lynette and Riley sold number twenty-six. Got you down. Lynette will never have to go get her nails done again. She has it at home. I know. She won't have to pay for it. Number 27. This is the raw sugar sanitizer two-pack. So what we're doing is they're both the same bottles. This one's missing the pump. So we figure, well, you can just use it as a refill and take this cap, put it on this one, and ta-da, you have two bottles. Number 27, $5. That's why we priced it so low for both of them. Genie's Everything says, can you do more fire sales Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday? <laughs> we wish if we had the time. Yep. <laughs> we would if we, we had We actually the time. just got contacted by a company that is trying to figure out how to do fire sales like... Uh, to streamline it. Like streamline it. Yep. So. So, uh, Ronald Brown, sold number 27. Got it. Ronald Brown, got you down. I think it was Ronald Brown, right? Yeah, Ronald Brown, yep. All right, here is an extra large dog bundle. So those of you who with big puppies, we have a cool extra large cutter and we have a cool leash that is for an extra large dog. Actually, it's a collar for an extra large dog. Number 28, $10 for this. I just like that cool cable knit sweater there for the dog. Some Hopefully of these dogs dress better than I do. Yeah, they do. They dress better than all of us. Uh, Tony Corcoran, sold number 28. There's there's the back of Lexi's head. Whoop. Yep. Oh, it's in front of her face. Yep. So she actually is helping us today. So she'll be receiving all the super chats that happen, which a couple of you have already done. Awesome. Extra extra small dog bundle. So a nice little scarf. This one's only $7.50. So you get the scarf and the little sweater. Super cute. Extra small, $7.50 for the extra small pet bundle. So you can do dog or a cat. And you can do the cute little bandana too. 
Just seven fifty on that one there. Seven fifty on this one, yep. And this too can be your dog. Or cat. They look happy. They do. Happy in those clothes. How do you think they got the dog to smile? <laughs> Photoshop. Photoshop? <laughs> Could be Photoshop. <laughs> anyway, so extra small dog bundle still available at seven dollars and fifty cents. Number twenty nine. So you're gonna go sold number twenty nine. This is for 29. extra small. Extra small. The bandana is actually kind of a it's a one size, size fits all, yeah. but this is extra small. Yeah, but this is half price because normally this would this whole bundle yeah. regular price would be fifteen dollars. <gasps> our, our cousin, our cousin bought it. Vivian Hook sold number twenty nine. <laughs> Vivian, you're just part of the family already. But she's gonna be looking for family discount before you know it. I know. All right, then we have reading glasses. These are plus two point five zero reading glasses. Really nice, kind of just brownish color. Um, plain, simple pattern on them if you're a new buyer please make sure you send me your contact info to hooked on picking.com because uh, see the beauty sold number 30 is e-transfer possible e-transfer e-transfer uh, for a, payment no is that a payment uh no no but we do uh have uh secure credit card check out check out through uh our yeah. shopify Yep. Which is what Hooked on Picking is built So on. what you're going to do is if you purchase on today's sale, you get an invoice from me, and you'll just pay the invoice. It will have an itemized list of everything that you purchased on the fire sale. Did you get See the Beauty for sale number 30? I did get See the Beauty. All right. I only had one of those, Nicole, so, All right. so sorry. See the Beauty. You're going to have to also send me your contact info to the, to the uh, comment right above yours so that I can properly invoice you. So I will need your name and your street address. So that I can invoice you. Yep. Even if you bought off Hooked on Pickin', let me know because I won't be able to recognize you with your fun YouTube name. Shave Gel, two-pack, $2.50. You're going to get both of these containers for two fifty. We have two sets. We have a tutu. We have a tutu. Ronald Brown, sold number 31. Uh, my daughter's school, the younger one, Faith, they wore tutus on yep. 2 22, 22. And uh, <laughs> Jeannie's Everything, sold number 31. Got you down. And that's all I had, so sorry, Susan. All and right. 32. Okay, so we looked this up, and it is outrageous how much this costs. It's yeah, a 10 it hair restoration spray. So it's like a, a leave-in conditioner style, but it's for hair restoration. It's supposed to really help if you've got hair loss going on or if you got really brittle, broken hair. So number 32, $20 for this very large container of the It's a 10 hair. It is sold. Elizabeth Golden. Okay. Elizabeth Golden sold number 32. Awesome. All right, this is the Ray Vitamins, $10 for the Ray Vitamins. Support um, your hormones. Yes. Everybody. You will not be moody or bloated. <laughs> Ever again. Says it right on the box, everybody. <laughs> Someone's like, do I get a discount or a refund if that doesn't work? <laughs> So, Ray Vitamins, $10. It's basically a natural supplement that you take to kind of balance. There's a lot that. of things we could say about this supplement right yes, now. Yes, $10. <laughs> That's why Paul is being Just excited. pass it out at church. Just pass it here. Everybody you're walks good. in, take this pill. Yep. You're moody. Here, You're moody, <laughs> and you're bloated. <laughs> no, you're no longer are you going to be bloated or moody. Have a good day. <laughs> Sometimes when I eat too much food, I'm bloated. So That's will true. that help? Potlucks. We could Pot have. Lux. We could have this Just, at the end of the potluck yes, table. Put it in the dessert table. <laughs> Minimizes bloating. <laughs> That'd be good. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Uh, so Ray Vitamins, ten dollars. It is uh, basically a hormonal, um, all natural supplement. Number thirty three, ten dollars. All right, that is still available. Number thirty four, Carol's daughter conditioner. Carol's Daughter Conditioner, $5 uh, for this conditioner. Uh, really cool. Um, $5. for the, It's a very large bottle. For it is $5. a large bottle. Yeah. So we, we had some Carol's Daughter, like, um, leave-in hair cream, I think, before. Mm -hmm. And that sold really, really fast. So this is with aloe. Yeah, with aloe. So it's supposed to be... And they then put the sticker over it, so it's hard to read some yeah. of it. Number 34, $5 for the Carol's Daughter Conditioner. So... Yeah, we had 313 people on right now, 110 awesome. thumbs up. Wow, we had 100 thumbs up pretty fast. <laughs> Trina says, my husband probably would buy you out if it would guarantee me not being moody. <laughs> uh, Sarah, it's number 34, but Chick Benny got it. Sold number 34, Chick Benny. Chick Benny got it. 
All right, the hair dye bundle. Okay, I want a little crazy bundling these together, but I thought it was really fun. So you can put teal streaks in, and then this is red hair. So I feel like this combination is really super fun. Number 35, $7.50. They are not expired, and everything is fully intact. And so you can put the teal color in or use the red hair dye. Number 35. Or half your head could be teal. The other half could be red. Uh, red. I feel like that's good. Yep, I feel like all them. of it red with teal streaks. Vivian says, when do I send my information? At uh, you can Fiction? send it. I need it within 30 minutes of the completion of this live stream. So we usually run about an hour and a half from noon. So about an hour from now, as soon as we get done, just go ahead and shoot me an email. Or you can send it now. No problem. Okay. Elizabeth Brown uh, is asking for some questions here real quick. Are you ready? Yeah. Uh, is number 13 sold? Number 13 is already sold, yes. Is number 19 sold? I am looking. Number 19 is already sold. Number 22 sold. Number 22 is already sold. 23. Number 23 is already sold. Number 31. Number 31 is already sold. I am so sorry, Elizabeth. They're all sold. So. But 35 is available, Elizabeth. Yes. Elizabeth, we have number 35 with the teal and red hair. It would be beautiful. It would be beautiful. I feel like you should just dye your pets red and green. I don't know. Is that dye your pets, pets, Heather? I don't know. I don't know. Is that a thing? Do people well, dye their pets? I've actually watched a deal where somebody did like natural hair color on pets. <laughs> Andrew Elder's like, I spend like fifty dollars every fire sale, but it's all in snacks. <laughs> well, um, that's because that's what the best. Linda thing Dunn is. says thirty three is sold. Thirty three is sold. No. Thirty three is not sold. No, it is not. Thirty three is available apparently. So does Linda want it? Hold on a second. I don't know. So, in order to buy, all you're going to do is type sold, then whatever number. And then we'll write you down as purchasing it. So, Linda, just let us know. Were you trying to buy that one? Just say yes, trying to buy, or something and to that extent, and we'll put you down. Um, and so, you're going to write, in order to buy, because we have a lot more people on now, so we can kind of go through the rules real fast. If you want, in order to buy, you're going to type sold, be the first one. We'll announce your name. Make sure you're in live chat, not top chat. You will get an invoice via hookedonpicking.com, sent by today or tomorrow evening. Check your spam folder, pay with secure credit card checkout. If you buy over $100 on today's sale, you'll be able to get free shipping if you live in the lower 48 of the United States. Linda Dunn, sold number 33. Perfect. Got you down, Linda. All right, and then Moving you will on. also need to send me your contact info if you're a new buyer. Even if you uh, think, if you bought off what I'm picking, I also need an email saying, hey, I bought off the fire sale so I can make sure that I match your YouTube name to your real name. Vivian says, where do I send my information at Hooked on Picking? Um, I just added it in the chat right Did there. Did you just add it on the chat? Yeah. There you go, Vivian. All right. This is, this is some detangler. 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 Texture Tamer 750. Yep, texture tanger detangler. Do you ship to Israel? Uh, we do ship internationally. I believe Israel is on the list, yes. Yep. I, I think we have once before. Yep. But uh, every once in a while, international stuff, they change rules on us pretty quickly. Yep. So If we run into an issue where I can't ship it, I will let you know. Okay? Mm -hmm. um, so this one is a detangler, $7.50 for this. It's a really large container. We want easy. Texture tamer. It's amazing. Yep. All right. That one is still available. Don't drop stuff, please. <laughs> she did. What's anything major? All right. Number 37, $7.50. Itch lotion. So this is great if you have dry skin, um, if you have an irritant. Sometimes, you know, like if you go to the doctor, they use that adhesive and it, the itching won't go away. That's great for that. So $7.50 for the itch lotion. So... $7.50. It's a Sarah... Tony Corcoran, B. sold number 37. Okay, perfect. Tea tree oil, two-pack. You're going to get both of these for $2.50. We have three sets. Three sets of those. Three sets of those. So you're going to get both of those. Um, premium hair oil, tea tree oil, 99 Is, is number 36 still available? Number 36 is still available. Uh, Trina Jones, sold number 36. Trina Jones. Got it. Uh, Jeannie's Everything, sold number 38. Got it. Ronald Brown, sold number 38. Got it. Elizabeth Golden, sold number 38. And then I'm out of that there. Okay. So sorry for everybody else. I got a lot that wanted those. And then I got number 39 is... Acne Stress Control. 
control, acne stress control. So this is great if you feel like you break out. Uh, so does it control how stressed out your acne is? Or how, how stressed out you are with acne? I don't know. I feel like I'm confused a little. It anyway, is a power clear scrub. Yeah, so it's a scrub to help with the acne and to, to help clear that all up. $5 for that. $5 for that. So number 39, acne stress control, $5. Uh, whoop, is 3838 38 is gone? 38 is gone. Okay, 38 is sold. Deborah Hurt, sold number 39. Awesome. And number 40, we have two sets of these here. You get a, this little nice dog outfit, they're exactly identical. Small, size small. Size small dog outfit with these dog treats here. $7.50. Is what it is. Uh, 39 is gone, yes? Yes, yes 39, 39 is gone. gone. So, small dog bundle, $7.50. You get the exact same, they're both the exact same ones. So, you get the nice sweater and you get the dog treats to go with it. Uh, Mia T, sold number 40. Okay. I got one more set of this here. <laughs> 41 is outside the box. Yeah, it's on the very back. Right. There you go. All right. One more small dog bundle at $7.50. If you've arrived and we're already partway into the sale, don't worry. We go back through anything that didn't sell the first time around. So make sure you stay tuned. Lauren T. Sold number 40. Got you down, Lauren T. All right. That's all ahead of those. All right. Then we have Myers Hand Soap 2-Pack. A lot of people were asking about the Myers Hand Soap, so we're going to sell this. $5 for the 2-Pack. We have five sets. So you get both of those hand soaps. They are Acorn Spice Scent Buyer's Hand Soap. Um, and so we have... I got Cindy B825, sold number 41. That's a new name. Yep. Tell me when you got that one, Heather. I'm just trying to spell it right. Yep. Okay, go ahead. I got K Beckman, sold number 41. Okay. I have L Media Step, sold number 41. I have Michelle Raleigh, sold number 41. Okay. I have Glor Gloria Arnold, sold number 41. All right, perfect. Uh, if you are a new buyer on our fire sale, please send me your contact info. There's no way I can access your info unless you email me. Number 42, $15. This is a medicine bundle. Comes with sunscreen, melatonin, uh, neosporin on the go, um, some corner movers. It's got some laxative. Laxatives. It's got you name it. All things medicine in there. So fifteen dollars for everything in that entire bag. Fifteen dollars for everything in that entire bag. Fifteen dollars for everything inside one of those bags. It is gone. Michelle yeah. Raleigh, sold number forty-two. Got you down, Michelle. We went crazy putting stuff in bags. All right, so we have, these are makeup bundles, and so they come with um, a bunch of different makeup items, $15, and we have got six of them available. You're going to get a, a wide variety of things inside um, each one of these bundles, and so you'll get one just randomly selected, makeup bundle, $15. I do believe one of them has that tea tree yep. oil in it. M Melissa Hodges, sold number 43. Okay. Yeah, a lot of people like the little goodie bags that we do, so thank you for, for doing those. Okay. Uh, Ronald Brown, sold number 43. Got it. Roxanne Majewski, sold number 43. Got it. Gloria Arnold, sold number 43. Got it. And how many do I have left? Two. Uh, Ronald Brown wanted three, so okay. he gets the last two there. So he'll have three total. Correct. All right. Awesome. All right, they are gone. I've got a few more bundles over here. These are all hair care bundles. They're going to come with a variety of things used for your hair. And so they are $10 only. Yep. And we have three total. So hair care bundles. Everything $10. to do with lotion or hair. Conditioner. Conditioner, shampoo. Conditioner, highlighter spray. Yep. Hair care bundle, 10 bucks is all. 10 bucks. 41 is gone, correct? Uh, looking, I think so. 
Yep, 41 is gone. Yep. The Myers hand soap. We did, if you're looking for the Myers dish soap, we did put the Myers dish soap on the store. So it is mum scented. So if you type in Myers mum scented or dish soap mum, M U M, you'll be able to find it very easily. Teresa Snow, soul number 44. Okay. Leah Hobbs, soul number 44. Got it. Mia, Mia T, soul number 44. Perfect. Got you guys. Hold on a second. Trina Jones says I meant 43. Yeah, I'm out of 43. I think you might be a little bit behind. Yep. You can try to exit. Trina, and yeah. A lot screen. of people wanted 44 also. Okay. We'll keep trying to make these bundles as soon as yep. we can. All right. Now, just FYI, all of the containers for Mama's Kitchen are larger today. Um, and so this is a double size container. It's usually a 16 ounce container. This one's like 34 ounces. So it's much larger. So um, we have this is no bake cookies, $20 for a double size yep. $20 with two of these containers available. It, it would be like getting two containers from yeah, our two previous of the sales. regular size containers. Yep. So I only have two. Are you ready, Heather? Yep. Go ahead. Andrew Elder, sold number 45. He was waiting for these. Yeah, he is. Gloria Arnold, sold number 45. So those are gone. I don't have as many. All right, the peanut butter fudge, same thing. We have two of them available, and it's a double size container for $20. Double size container for twenty dollars. Two of them available. Mama's Kitchen peanut butter fudge. So twenty dollars for the Mama's Kitchen peanut butter fudge. Andrew Elder sold number forty six. And then Mia T sold number forty six. Perfect. Got you down. All right, now those of you who love the low sugar no bake cookies, uh, she made a bunch more of these. So we actually have four containers of this. So it would be like buying a double pack of the other size. Um, and so $20, four of the containers available for the low sugar no bake cookies. And what she uses instead, she uses less sugar. And then she also does the um, half of it is uh, monk fruit sweetener, which has got no aspartame in it. And so it's really, really good. And they're very sweet. I can't tell the difference between these and the regular no bake cookies. Emily Bacon, sold number 47. I've got three more. Three more of the low sugar no bake cookies. I mean, she they're crammed in there. Look at that. Yep. Emily Bacon would like times two. Great. They got two more. Two more left. Low sugar no bake cookies. Susan Van, sold number 47. So would I have one more? Susan, we haven't seen you in a little bit, at least not comment on a fire sale in a little bit. So good to see you. Susan Van's been a viewer forever. One more left of the low sugar no bake cookies. I think they taste just as good as the regular ones. I am a no bake cookie fan. It's my, one of my favorite cookies. Ooh, Dana's watching while laying in the hospital after after, after having a full knee replacement on Tuesday. Oh, no fun. That doesn't sound like fun. Well, we'll be praying that you heal fast. Yeah. I haven't had the knee replacement. I had knee surgery when I was younger, but so the joys of rehab. You'll do great. You'll do great. Hang in there. The low sugar is great for my mom who is a diabetic. Yes. yes. It doesn't spike that blood sugar. This, this recipe yep. does not. Mm -hmm. I have one more, right? You know, my dad and my brother are both diabetic. All right, one more left of the low sugar no bake cookies. All right, still have one of those. This is chocolate pecan fudge. Chocolate pecan fudge. We have three containers of these. This is a double batch, so it most of the time the containers are 16 ounces. This one is 34 ounces, so it's a little more than a double batch. So chocolate pecan fudge, twenty dollars. Chocolate pecan. Uh, pecan. Lynette and Riley sold number 47. Okay. Got it. So chocolate pecan fudge, and I tell you what, this is so yummy. And then I got Andrew Elder, sold number 48. Got it. I got Pam Graham, one, one mo, sold number 48. Okay, that's it. I had three of these, didn't I? Yep, you have three. Lynette and Riley, Andrew Elder. No, me. Lynette and Riley got number 47, Heather. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, go ahead. Does Mama Kitchen make low sugar fudge? Oh, we Have we ask. ever had low sugar fudge? Uh, I'm looking how to spell the pan thing. I can't find it. Okay, it is. I got it. You found it? Yeah. Pam Graham, one mo. Yep. 
creative names, aren't, aren't yeah. we? We're good at creative names. All right, one more. Uh, Rhonda Smith, soul number 48. And then I only have one of these. This is number 49. Yep, this is Raisin Fudge. Raisin Fudge. Yep, Chocolate Raisin Fudge. $20, only one. Only one of the Chocolate Raisin, raisin Fudge. Andrew Elder, soul number 49. He, he, knows, he knows he loves Andrew knows fudge. a good thing. Yes, he does. All right, this is our normal size container. So yep. we have two of these. These are, are just $10. Yep, these are just $10. Caramel chocolate fudge. So this is the caramel chocolate fudge. And so this is our traditional size container of the 16 ounces. Caramel chocolate fudge, $10. Two of them available. This is fantastic. Oh, he got I had, a, I had a piece of this last night. Yeah, it's fantastic. They're gone. Lynette and Riley, sold number 50. And Emily Bacon, sold number 50. Okay. That's it. It's all yeah. on that there. How many of you remember these? Gold mine, bubble gum. This is the gold that Paul is always looking for. I'm always looking for gold. Yeah, so this is a bag of bubble gum for $2.50. It comes looking like gold. $2.50. We have 24 of these, so these are a really fun kind of party favor. Um, and if you look inside, I wonder if I can open one. I don't don't open it. One. Don't open it. You'll spill right. the gold. Uh, Jeannie, Jenny's Everything, still number 51. Okay. I'm probably still butchering that name. If you want more than one, say times, whatever. Yep, you can write times, um, two times, three times, five. Michelle Raleigh, sold number 51. I think the bag alone could probably be sold for 250 It's pretty cool. It's a cool little miner on there. You got Michelle Raleigh? Yep. See the Beauty, sold number 51. All of your shipping will be combined for everything on today's fire sale. Did you get See the Beauty? Yep. Chick Benny, sold number 51. Lisa Trotner, sold number 51 times 2. Got it. Deborah Hurt, sold number 51. Got it. Roxanne Majeski, sold number 51 times 3. Okay. Tanya Styers, sold number 51 times 2. How many do I have left? A bunch. Okay. Uh, Sarah Wiley, sold number 51 times 2. Okay. Angela Burden, sold number 51 times 6. Okay. Uh, still have some? Yep. Chick Benny, sold number 51 times 3. It's bubble gum. That was it. That's it? Oh, wait, no, 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 one more. One more left. I have one more. Well, Lynette Riley said sold number 51 times four, okay. so we can put her down for one. Yep. It's gum. Yes, it is. It's the greatest gum you've ever wanted in all your life. It's golden. It's golden. It's a all gold right. nugget gum. Golden nugget gum. All right, this is a really, the other one, that, the one that's coming up now is super fun. This is called Sour Truck Candy. It's actually a rolling truck. So, and it's filled full filled, of filled, sour candy. Full of sour candy. Uh, my truckload of sour candies. It's number and 52. So, number 52. We only have six of these available at six bucks a piece. So it's an entire truck full of sour candy and it's a toy. Like I said, all we do today is... Truckload of sour. Truckload of sour. So we're just playing with toys uh, Jenny's, today. Jenny's Everything, sold number 52. Aren't these great? Found these just not, not too long ago. When we're going to go to ASD. ASD Market Week, I'm looking for a bunch of more uh, candy vendors. We also did get contacted by a couple of viewers saying that they were going to be there. We'd love if you would send yep. me an email if you're going to be there and we'll meet up. Yeah, Tanya Styers, sold number 52. Elizabeth says cute for Easter baskets. Yeah, I think they would be good. Roxanne Majeski, soul number 52. Three left. Kathy Pham Journey, soul number 52 times two. Okay, give me a second to find her name. See it there? No, I don't. I don't see it. Number what's 52? 
Yep. Okay, it's a C, not a K. Yeah. While we're waiting, there is Lexi. She's getting all the super chats today. Yep. Yeah, she's she's saving for a car. What yep. car are you going to get? One that works. One that works? <laughs> a cheap one is what she's going to get. <laughs> Kathy Fam Journey is getting two, and then I have Chick Benny. We only have one left. There's Chuck Hooks over there. He ready he, to pack and ship. Ready to pack and ready ship. Ready to pack yeah. and ship. This is a family affair. Family affair today, apparently. You, you did get Kathy Fam Journey now? Yep, and I just got one for Chick Benny. Chick Benny, yes. Uh, she wanted four. We only had one left. So there you go. Okay, perfect. Um, well, I'll let you guys do that. All okay. right. There's another really fun one. So this is called Cosmic Moonshot Candy Game. So it's literally a game um, that you can play with. Look at this. You shoot these things, the bubble gum. See? Yeah. Remember that with the little marble? It's so fantastic. You can play with it, then eat it. It's like a pinball machine with your candy. Four dollars. We have twelve of these available. Four dollars, twelve available. Cosmic Moonshot Candy Game. You can actually tell your kid they can play with their food. Gonna be awesome. Let's see here. Uh, here we go. You ready, Heather? Yeah. Carla Howe, sold number 53 times two. Got it. Janice Canavan, sold number 53 times two. These are even kind of Eastery colors, too, yeah. which is kind of cool. Okay. Uh, uh, Cindy B825, sold number 53 times two. Okay. Uh, Kay Beckman, sold number 53 times two. Uh, Chick Benny, sold number 53 times two. Okay. Two left. Two left. Well, Angela Burton wanted six, so we can give you two. All right. We're going to try to get more of these and put them on the store and make them available. Yes. B boot that guy. Okay. Ink, ink pen with no ink. Uh, Michelle Raleigh donated $10. Thank you. That was very kind of you. And then Sandy Drake donated $10. Good luck, Lexi. Yep. <laughs> very good. Okay, good. Um, no. Oh, he's going off mine. I still have the comments popping up on mine. Hold on, let me see if I can try to pull it oh, off. Hold on. I got it. Got it? Yep. There we go. Do we have any more 53? Uh, no, that's it. Nope, 53 is gone. All Sorry. right. Had to deal with a rude person. All right, yep. number 54, cleaning life with eucalyptus. Now, this is about double what the orange ones are, I think, because how many are in this one, um, in this container? Uh, this one 150. 150. Um, and so this one's $5. We have a bunch of these available. So if you want more than one, they're really great. Completely, totally sealed. And so cleaning wipes, eucalyptus, $5. And apparently so, they are koala. Yes. No need for gloves. Yep. So they're supposed to be really safe. Yep. Yep. Uh, let's see. I do have a few already going here. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let us know if you want more than one because we've got about 20 some. 25. 25. 25. Lisa yeah. Trotner, sold number 54. Got it. Janice Canavan, sold number 54. Got it. Sarah Wiley, sold number 54. Uh, Cynthia, let's Cynthia see. Cynthia B. Cynthia, yeah. <laughs> We're not going to try to do Is it. Is uh, Belly, sorry. no, Bell, Bell Fuel, Fuely. So there's probably an easier way to say that, Cynthia. Sorry about that, Cynthia. Sold number 54 for Cynthia. Okay. Uh, 53 we're out of, correct? Correct. So Kathy Fan, we're out of 53. We're on number We're on 54. 54. You might have made the mistake of the numbers there, though. Tanya Stars, sold number 54. Got it. Having a real hard time getting that to go up there. There we go. Bella Fay. Bella Fay. I know a Bella Fay. Yeah, Cynthia Bella Fay. That's cool. I know a Pastor Bella Fay. Mm -hmm. I just didn't know how that's how he, he spelled his name. I bet you that's how he spells his name. Uh, Sarah Wallace said sold another 54. Okay, so she wants two total? Correct. Got it. Okay. 
All right, so we've got a bunch more of the cleaning wipes, eucalyptus style if you want more. Um, they're really nice, uh, and you don't have to wear gloves while wearing them and stuff like that, so they're perfect. Andrew Elder wants more of the Rocky Road fudge. That was amazing. Okay, well, let Mama's Kitchen know. Uh, let's see. Do we have up? Oh, yep. Uh, Cynthia Bellafay would like another 54. Perfect. Got you down, Cynthia. Moving on? Yep. Okay. All right, here's a really cool uh, novel. We've got The Dutch House, a novel by Ann Patchett, The Dutch House, large print edition. So that's kind of nice for us that uh, get a little bit <laughs> blurry as the, the years go on. So number 55, $10 for this fun novel. Um, it's called The Dutch House. It's about a Dutch house. You want me to read the back? Let's see. It says... Set over the course of five decades, the Dutch house is a dark fairy tale about siblings who cannot overcome their past. Despite every outward sign of success, Danny and Mauve are only truly comfortable when they're together. Throughout their lives, they return to the well-worn narrative of what they've lost with humor and rage. But when at last they're forced to confront the people who left them behind, in the relationship between an indulged brother and his ever-protective sister is finally tested. Awesome. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, Cabana Bob donated $5. Awesome. Lakes doing great. You're up to $40. For the car fund. You can almost buy a gallon of gas. <laughs> um, Joanna McGuire, Summer 54 times 2. Okay, she's going to get some of the wipes. And there are several people saying it's a great book. Oh, great. Got a couple more books coming up. We haven't done books in a while. No, this don't. one is a Tom Clancy novel, Code of Honor. Uh, it's a Jack Ryan novel, if anybody knows that. I know they got the miniseries now on, on TV, too. Yeah. $7.50. Number 56. Also a good book, endorsed by Sunshine Badges and More. <laughs> Sunshine Badges and More is a teacher. It's hard to beat Tom Clancy. It really is. I feel like I'd read anything endorsed by Sunshine Badges and More. It's true. <laughs> so, Code of Honor, $7.50. It's a nice hardcover back, too. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's hardcover. It's not uh, paperback. Brand new. It was twenty nine ninety five. What? But only seven fifty dollars here. Uh, Glory Arnold, sold number 55. Okay. She's getting the Dutch house. <laughs> Andrew's like, you didn't have enough food. I only spent $80 on food. <laughs> Uh, Buy a book to, to eat the food and read the book. <laughs> Sherry, Sherry Mitchell sold number 56. Okay, great. And Janice Kenneman donated $5. Lexi's up to $45. Just think of the car she'll have. Yep. It's going to be awesome. Now it might have tires. All right, number 57, $5. This is The Girl from Widow Hills, a novel from Megan Miranda. We have several of these, I think, right? Yeah, we have three of them. Shall I read the back in dramatic fashion? I'm always afraid when you so, do that. Is, oh, it's on the inside. Inside cover. Inside cover. Well, here, I'll grab one of the other ones. Ooh. All right, ready? Ready? Go for it. If you want, Heather will sign the inside cover for you. <laughs> Jan Brown, sold number 57. Awesome. She we already knew it was good. Two more. Now everybody's just waiting until I read it. Arden Maynard was just six years old when she was swept away while sleepwalking during a terrifying rainstorm. <gasps> Strangers and friends, neighbors and, and rescue workers set up search parties and held vigils, praying for a safe return. Against all odds, she was found alive and clinging to a storm drain. The girl from Widow Hills is a living miracle. Arden's mother wrote a book. Fame followed. Fans and fan letters, creeps and stalkers. And every year of the anniversary, as soon as she was old enough, Arden changed her name and disappeared from public eye. Now a young woman living in hundreds of miles away, Arden has built a life as Olivia Meyer. With the 20th anniversary of the rescue approaching, the media inevitably renews its interest. Soon, Olivia feels like she's being watched. She begins sleepwalking again. Late one night, she jolts awake in her yard, only to find her feet at the corpse of a man she knows from her previous life as Arden Maynard. <gasps> oh, my dun, word. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, Jenny's Everything donated $5. Lex, thank you for your help today. Awesome. You're at $50. Holy cow. Uh, is it Janae Sass? Uh, sold number 57. Awesome. Uh, forgive me if I mispronounce your name. I'm not, not trying to do it on purpose. I just have a term 
Hard time reading. I just can't read. <laughs> oh, right. she says, never mind. She has that one. Sorry. Oh, okay. She's buying for a friend, I guess. All right, two more left of those. Uh, Joanne McGuire says, uh, did you see I want 54 times two? Um, let me look. Yeah, I did get Joanne McGuire. Okay, we two. got you, Joanne. And then Teresa Snow, sold number 57. Perfect. So what do I have? One more 57? One more left. And it's gone. Lynette and Riley, sold number 57. Okay. This is King our King of Prussia. We have five book. of these. This is the last book we have. So this one is King of Prussia is a fascinating journey through, the, through time by way of thought-provoking images from the late 19th century. Follow the growth of the community through this timeless collection of photographs depicting majestic homes, thriving businesses of which some still exist today, and others that have fallen in the name of progress. From picturesque and humble beginnings, these rare photographs documents, document how King of Prussia has grown to become a leader in commerce, hosting over 10 million visitors a year. So, really fun stuff. Kind of a trip through memory lane. Very cool. Ten dollars, five of those available. Looks really cool. It's icing, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Pretty bad. All right, King of Pressure, five of those available. Uh, we do keep these prices for the next twenty. Jam rounds at ten dollars. Uh, yes, the book is ten dollars. <laughs> She's making a proclamation. Might Oops, asked. meant for Lexi. Mm -hmm. That would be, uh, that's a super chat. Yep, you have to do a super chat. So yep. there's a little dollar sign um, next to the emoji at the bottom of your screen. you got to hit the dollar sign and then put the amount in. And you can even leave a comment. Good. Okay. Yep. Moving on. All righty. Number 59 is a 1953 Ford truck, 1953 Ford truck, pickup truck. It's the F100. It's still completely, it's die cast metal, completely wrapped, brand new. It's a 1 um, 34th scale of this cool truck. And so we don't really want to open the box and stuff, but it is completely wrapped and unharmed. Yep. Um, but a really cool display piece, 1953 Ford F100 truck. Ford F100 truck, $20. Yeah, we had today. two. We already sold one. Yeah, we did sell one already. Really nice. This one is cool because it comes with the box. A it's gone. Like Cabana it. Bob, sold number 59. All right. Hey, Cabana Bob. All right, now this is a special piece right here. These are hard to find from what I could look up on eBay. I found one other one for $200. Ours, though, is actually working. Mm -hmm. That one was not. Uh, cord is in really good shape, really good shape on this. Uh, number 60 is $150. It is an Art Deco brush nickel General Electric. And you'll automatically get free shipping because it's over the $100. Correct. Really, really nice. Really cool Art Deco clock. And I'm trying to see if I can read a model number if somebody wants the model number. Mm -hmm. The model number, Heather, if you want to read that, it says right after model. What? I know. 7H106. 7H106. Yep. Uh, somebody was clarifying something. So the Art Deco clock, $150 for number 60. Yep. 59 is gone, but we're on number 60. Pretty clock. Cool looking clock. Mm -hmm. I just like that it still works. That's kind of cool. That's yeah. Cool. A lot of people buy these just for their display, uh, you know, look to them because they're very, very, very kind of clever. Kind of that mid century lines to them. Mm hmm. Good. Yep. Moving on. All right. Number 61 is a Tonka blue tow truck with a little hitch that actually works. So you can tow your trucks around. This is a Tonka Wrecker truck, 24-hour service, blue Wrecker truck. This one is $50 for the old-school Tonka tow truck. I believe it's early 70s. They $50 kept, for number yeah, 61. They kept that body style for years. Yeah, they did. 
Yeah, from the 70s all the way through the 90s, I believe. The F-150 had kind of a style like this. Yeah, it did. So this is a Tonka Blue Metal tow truck. Was there only one of the trucks? Only one of the trucks. Roxanne Majeski. Yes, only one. Yeah, we only... Yeah, all of our metal trucks, we only have one of each kind. She needs everything. Is this a Dodge? It just says Tonka. Does that make sense to you? See? So, whatever Tonka wanted it to be. <laughs> Oh, look at that. Uh, Janina Seizure donated $50. Something for the car. Can't buy your stuff, unfortunately, because of the Danish customs fees. Oh, yeah. sad face. Uh, Danish, are you in the Netherlands? Yeah, we know, maybe. we know, I know a pastor in the Netherlands. We do. Daniel we do. Boyd. Well, thank you so much for the huge de donate. That was what, 50 bucks? Yeah. Nice. Craig Wolf says, I think I had that truck when I was growing up. You can <laughs> have it again, Craig Wolf. Yes, you can. You can have it again. Uh, Pam Graham One Mo says, "Can I combine what I have in my cart on your website to what I'm getting on this auction to save on shipping?" Uh, you can do combined shipping. Just send us an email within 30 minutes following the stream. There's no adjustments on invoices past that 30 minute mark. So go ahead and just send me an email, yep. and we'll make that adjustment. And then Andrew Elder says, "Do you still have any of the spicy suckers?" Yes, yes they're on the store. And then Trina Jones sold number 61. Okay. That is a cool truck. Have fun with that one. Perfect. We got you Here's down. an old one. Yep, this is a Structo truck, blue in color, silver on the front. Structo Construction Company. And um, really, really neat. And it actually does tilt back all the way. Look Isn't that at that. Cool? Look at that. It's actually still working. Yep, so you can use this little handle, tilt it up and down. This one is much older. And I could not find the silver model. Uh, I could find a white model but not the silver on eBay. So uh, $75 is what we're asking for there. I saw them anywhere between 120 and 60. I thought, well, well let's go 75 because- Ours is in I, working condition. Yeah, it's working and condition it's, and it's I couldn't find the color, the right color. So I don't know, it's probably worth $300 and I just don't know. That'll kill me later. <laughs> $75 uh, Structo truck blue. Yep, good decal, both sides. Yep, that's pretty unique that you can read yep. those that old. A lot of times those are all worn off. There you go. All right. Then we have this cool tractor with wagon with a little hopper in the back. Cool red guy driving the tractor. And so number 63, $30 comes with the wagon. Everything does roll and move, and it is completely metal. And so um, really, really cool, nice piece. So, the tractor with wagon, $30. Yay! See, we're just playing with toys today. Really in good shape. This is Paul's favorite fire sale because he gets to play with so many toys. That's right. Toys. Get to roll trucks and tractors and stuff. Trucks with sour candy in them. That's true. We had that too. <laughs> yeah. Number 63, $30. Gold bags of gum. For the die cast metal uh, tractor with hopper on the back. Mm-hmm. With wagon. Wagon. 63 is number 30. Yep, 63 is $30. Uh, Nicole says, did I miss more health and beauty? Had a delivery. Um, uh, depending on when you went out, I don't know. We did the health and beauty bundles. That was the last it's one. kind of in the beauty. middles when we did those. Yeah. Yep. We'll see. The second round is coming up here soon. We'll see what's left. Yep. All right. Number sixty-four, fifty dollars. Number sixty-four, fifty dollars. This is the um, Tonka Farm truck. Tonka Farms. It says Mound, Minnesota. The decals can be seen on the front of the truck cab and also on the bed there. Tonka Farms. Cool um, cow picture, kind of steer cow picture on the back. Yeah. Really cool. So Tonka Farm trucks, fifty dollars for the flatbed truck. Kind of that baby blue light color. Baby blue light color. Really on that. cool looking truck. Really kind of looks. Well it has worn. the headlights still too, which yep. often get gone. Cool. With the headlights. Yeah, Ash is like Paul's just been playing with toys the last ten minutes. Yes, yeah, look at has. that. Look Tonka, at that. Yeah, it Tonka does have the headlights. Farm truck. I think that's actual glass in there. Yeah. That is really cool. I just like the cool body style. Yep. 
And it's a lot cheaper than actually buying an old truck. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Lexi could buy a truck. Though. Yeah, Lexi, you could buy this truck. You're looking for a vehicle. <laughs> the only problem, she can't drive it. <laughs> well, she could, put she could knee, yeah, she could put her knee here. <laughs> scoot down scoot down on down the road. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Uh, Janine's everything. These uh, Janine's everything says these trucks are great. Thanks, Papa Chuck. All right. All right. Moving on. Number sixty-five is the Structo truck. It has got a yellow bed, and then it is red and black on the front end. Uh, yellow, uh, kind of dump truck style, and that does open at the back and tilt and all that fun stuff. So everything is still movable and functional. So you can put stuff in there and actually sit like a dump truck. Number sixty-five, fifty dollars. I love the front end, kind of the sleek lines on that front end. Yeah. Fifty dollars for the red, black, and yellow. Pretty sure it's dump S truck. for. For struck though, there of course. Sharp. And a lot of these are just completely rusted out. Yep. I saw them on eBay that were just trash. Yep. And this one looks really nice. Yeah, that one's beautiful. The wheels are still good. It's also original paint and all of that. Yep, still free flowing. So, really nice. $50 for number 65. So we will, don't go anywhere because we will go back through a second round. So if you jumped on the sale late, we will go back through anything that did not sell the first round. So these are some of our antique finds. We'll go back through some of our new items as well. So don't go anywhere. We still have a few more things. Um, it won't take us too long to go back through round two. Here's number 66. It's an old one too. Okay, this is a Lumar truck. Red body, blue... Um, blue kind of dump and then yellow a little hatch at the back 66 is 60 dollars really sleek front end this is a lumar contractor marks truck lumar contractor marks truck 60 dollars for number 66 60 dollars for number 66 definitely has age to it Okay, let's see. Janine Sager just donated two hundred dollars in DKK, which is in Danish. Danish. Um, so it didn't quite get to the actual fifty dollars. So she basically donated more. So again, close closer to the fifty dollar or whatever twenty dollar mark or whatever yep. mark it was. So you're at eighty seven forty six. Yes. Are you excited? Eighty seven forty six because Danish currency just translates different in dollars. Oh. So you're at yep. eighty seven forty six total. That's amazing. Wow. Yep. Very nice, very kind. Thank you so much. Nice. Alrighty, so this is the Lumar Red Truck, $60. Yep, it's number 66 on this one here. Let's see if I can get, there we go. So the total was 37.50. dollars There you go. Donated. That's cool. Thank you so much. Very, very from. kind. Yep, for dollars. Her car fund's growing. Yep. All right, number 67 is a broken jewelry lot. You're going to get everything in there. All the pieces are broken. A lot of people like to use them for crafts. So we're just going to sell the whole lot of all of the boxes are an individual piece of jewelry. And so you've got one, two, three, four, five, six total things in that bag. $67 for 15 bucks. And a lot of them are pretty, really pretty. Really pretty. One of them is This actually, is Swarovski or yeah. however you say it. And then I think we included some of the other fun ones that we have shown in previous unboxings. Number 67, 15 dollars Nicole, you always have to say sold or we just think you're asking a question. Yeah, in there, sold so. Them the number, sold them. Um, I got Katie Beckman, sold number sixty-seven. Perfect. All right, so. you're gonna get your um invoice today or tomorrow. It'll probably be within a couple of hours today. We're gonna start boxing everything up, but we will go through, back through the second round. So we're gonna back basically pull some things out, um, and let you know ex uh the items that didn't sell the first round. And so I'll go through the payment while you yep. want to grab the stuff there. Payments must be made within 72 hours. An, uh, an invoice from hookedonpicking.com will be sent to you by today or tomorrow evening. Most likely today unless we like lose power because of the ice storm or something. Check your spam folder. That's always important to check your spam folder because sometimes it goes there. Why that happens, I'm not really sure. Pay with a secure credit card uh, is available to you to be able to do that there. 
Uh, let's see here. hundred dollars. You spend more than a hundred dollars. You get free shipping in the lower 48 States. If you're a new buyer and we had lots of new buyers on there today, uh, please send an email with your address and YouTube name to hooked on picking.com. Contact me or hooked on picking at gmail.com. Okay. Andrew elder just donated 20 more dollars because he wanted to make it a Benjamin that you actually, that is awesome. hundred bucks today. All right. You're at $107 you and 46 cents. Thank Could you. you say thank you? <laughs> Thanks. Very good. <laughs> Your voice is almost gone. All right. Okay, what All are right, we, we starting over down here? So these are the things that did not sell first round. So number two is available, the wooden pulley for $25. It is a free moving wooden pill pulley with a beautiful curve on that cast iron. So we have that for $25. We're going to kind of go quick through these quickly. And so if we have passed it, don't worry. You can say still sold whatever number it is, and I'll write your name down. Number three is the bowling bookends, $20 for the clear bowling guy. He is bowling, and there's two available. Really cool decorative pieces, so you don't have to use them as bookends. You could use them as uh, stones and your garden anything you want so clear thick glass tw number three twenty dollars janice canavan donated ten dollars awesome thank you janice canavan lexi's yeah. racking up the money she is racking up the money that's awesome it's expensive to buy a car these days yeah it is all right janice canavan also janice canavan sold number three so the bowling bookends lexi if you want to move those there they are gone those are really cool and they are glass this Teresa is a snow 999 donation. Awesome. Thank you. Her smile is very big back here. Oh, wow, that is amazing. She's working hard. All right. So we still have this here. Yep. We still do. Awesome. It is actual wood. Yep. yep. And it's branded. Yep. It does have a brand on it, as you see there. Right there, as you can see. Manufacturing company. And then Nay, N E Y. 160, 160, and it is gone. Brenda Foot sold number two. All right, Brenda perfect. Foot. Uh, if you are a new buyer on today's sale, please send me your contact info. There's no way I can get an invoice to you unless you send me your info. Yep, very important. So let's see. This is the fire truck. It's a hundred dollars for the fire truck. It's 1957 press steel fire truck. It is Tonka. And then as you can see here, it does come with this fire extinguisher here. Hooks up to your actual garden hose. Will actually work there. Does come with original ladder here, which is a pretty big deal because these are almost always missing. Does come with this hose, which that quite often is missing when you're trying to look and find one of these. Um, and it does come with this piece here. Uh, the only thing that we are missing is a hose that connects from here to right there. And actually... It would it would pump water into the truck and this hose and would actually spray. can spray outside there, which is pretty amazing. You'll that get it free do that. shipping if you buy this truck because it is a hundred dollars already. Yes, and you would. So you won't have to worry about shipping costs. And the little uh, doors on the uh, Fire truck equipment are still there, which those are always gone too. Hundred dollars for number five. Okay. All right, number seven. Number seven is an automatic vintage red truck automatic vintage red metal truck so these are some of our auction finds we'll get into some of our new stuff here in just a minute um so a vintage automatic loading it says patent applied for on the side really mm -hmm. cool decals on that really cool decals on that sharp truck really okay, a sharp really truck sharp. it's an older one yep. probably looking at before world war ii or right around that yep. era really cool the little hinge on the back works, so if you put stuff in there, you can actually tip up the truck and dump it out. So yep. that's kind of fun. Cool so, truck. The stories this truck could tell. Number seven, $60. Yeah. Number eight, the mantle clock, $45. Now the front glass um, does fit fine. Just the hinge needs a little bit of TLC. It did chime while we were actually setting stuff up yesterday. Yep. Beautiful, beautiful old school chime on it. Does have the key. This is a Haven clock. New Haven. New, New Haven, Haven made in the USA. And it does come with the key and beautiful thing. Uh, inside inner workings in the pendulum swings freely. Yeah, nothing's locked up in it, which is a big deal. Uh, Jenny Lenhausen, sold number eight. The mantle okay. clock is sold. Right. Don't worry, she'll get you some more numbers in just a second, Lexi. Lexi's on it. She's like, nine. I need the next number. Nine and ten. Number nine and ten is coming back. Pretty clock, Jenny. Number nine is a table. As you can see, it's an amazing table. 
Nope, it's coming. All right, this is a really cool tractor with backhoe and bucket, and it does have a remote that comes with it. Now, the outside casing of the wire has cracked a bit just because of the years, um, but it looks like all of the wires are completely intact. It does have a little battery case inside of it with the buttons and the little steering wheel and everything, and look, that's brand new that still with beautiful. all of the information. Absolutely it's got the backhoe on it, and yes, it does unwind and wind up. We did that earlier when we displayed it, and so that's really, mm -hmm. really cool. And so you can get that one. It's number nine for $80. Number nine for $80 for the remote control mm -hmm. tractor. Number nine, $80. That's what it is there. It's a rare vintage Ford remote control tractor, uh, Craigston. And it's a 4,000. Yeah, there it is. Ford 4,000 4, HD Industrial. You see it there. Valerie Loeffler donated ten dollars. Awesome, thank you, Valerie. You guys are gonna single handedly buy her a car. That would be amazing. That would be awesome. It's all you need. What is that, Mr. Beast to hop on and just like bam, there's twenty thousand dollars to go buy a car. Right? Mr. Beast. <laughs> I don't think I've ever spent twenty thousand dollars on a car. <laughs> <laughs> no, we have not. Uh, All right, so that is still available. Number nine, eighty dollars for the Ford four thousand remote control tractor. Uh, Nicole says, do we need to send our information at every fire sale? Um, if, um, if, if I already have your information, I probably can find you again. But if you're concerned that I won't have your info, it's always good to just shoot me an email. Yep. Yep. Try to send me your information within the next 30 minutes because we start writing all the invoices out, packing your stuff, and then shooting them your direction. As soon as you pay, we get it in. We get it to the shipper and on the way. Number nine is still available. $80. Yep. Perfect. Number nine. All right, number 10, this is the Emerson Radio, really nice Philco Emerson Radio. Um, it's just missing one knob, but really cool vintage piece. Um, nice sleek lines for that mid-century look there for that. And number 10, $40 for the Emerson Radio. Number 10, $40 for the Emerson Radio. Andrew Elder says, I bought my, my first car for $250. <laughs> I think so, I bought my first car for five hundred. Yeah, mine yeah. was five hundred too. Uh, Jenny Linhausen sold number ten. The radio is gone. Perfect. Here's some health and beauty. Number thirty-five is seven dollars fifty cents. You get both of these hair colors. Hair colors. <laughs> if you're not sure if I have your contact info, or you're, even if you bought off Hooked on Pickin', you need to make sure that I know that it's you if you have a different name as a fun YouTube name. So please send me your contact info to what just popped up in the thread, Hooked on Pickin', no G on the end of that, pickin' at gmail.com. Constance is like, yeah, how many years ago was that, Andrew? Andrew's <laughs> like, I'm not telling. <laughs> He's a smart man. Smart man right there. Trina says, have your dad help you go out and find a cheap car. My first car would only cost me $250. Yeah. Yeah, We're there's probably some out there. Worry. That cash for clunkers, though, kind of sucked up a lot of the old jalopies out there. Yeah. But you probably wouldn't even want to drive an old jalopy, would you? I don't even know what that is. Well, he, she just wants to drive she one She just wants a runs. vehicle. Yeah. I uh, I got a good, sweet deal on a hearse at the, the no. local funeral department. <laughs> she will not drive a hearse. Yeah, you could. You can get a lot of people back there. <laughs> Dead or alive. Dead or alive? No, they could be alive. You know, they usually are great because they've been driven slow the whole time. Anyway. A lot of low miles on them. <laughs> no hot rodding with a hearse. It'd be sweet. <laughs> Number 54, we have a bunch of these cleaning wipes. So if you'd like more than one, I think we have about 20 available left. And so if you'd like the 150 pack of the cleaning wipes, then let us know. Just put down number 54 times however ma many you want. Ooh, Andrew bought his car only eight months ago for that deal. Really? Andrew's the man. He is the man. We're going to do a shop where Andrew shops. The clock. Number 54, $5. Get as many as you want. We have about... Tanya Steyer, sold number 54 again. Okay, perfect. Got you another one, Tanya. All right, so we have a bunch of these cleaning wipes. Eucalyptus smell. You don't need to wear a uh, gloves or anything like that, so they are healthy for your... Carrie Miller says your passengers won't complain about your driving if you drive a hearse. <laughs> I'm thinking it's perfect because a young driver, they see a hearse coming, they're going to pull off to the side of the road. They'll get out of the way. They'll get out of the way. Yep. 
That's a good deal. Plus, we'll keep the boys away. I even need. I even know the funeral home director. I probably could swing that deal pretty good, actually. <laughs> All right. He has a hard time selling them. That that's my next car. <laughs> I'm definitely getting one of those. All right, number fifty-eight, ten dollars. The King of Prussia, really, really cool book that has a lot of history involved and pictures and historical information. Ten dollars for one, and we have five available. Michelle Estrella hopped on. Michelle, we, we did have quite a few things uh, that haven't sold, so yep, feel, back feel free to go round. back through, Michelle. Yep, feel free to watch and then just send me an email. The, any of the auction finds that we uh, didn't sell, I try to put back on if I've had them on. Yep, so they'll be in so. the Fun Finds category. We just did add a bunch of new things to the Fun Finds category, so check that out. Uh, Pam Graham, one mo sold number 54. Okay. Michelle says, she says, I'll go back through it. Okay, perfect. That's awesome. Just send me an email, Michelle. I'll be on the lookout. Pam K says, me too. That's awesome, guys. Feel free to do it. Yeah, sometimes, like, can you imagine all the groceries that can fit in the back of a hearse? So much more practical than a van. I'm telling you, this is a great idea. Oh. Lexi? No. Lexi, come on. <laughs> this is a God-ordained idea. <laughs> she, she's no, getting some pretty good donations. No guy's going to even want to date you. <laughs> no. It's going to be fantastic. I love this. Purse it is. All right. Number 60. This is a cool clock. It really is. Yep. This is the Art Deco Brush Nickel General Electric. It is working. Cords in beautiful shape. $150. So I did find another one on eBay, but I can only find one. It did sell for $200 and it was not working. This one is working. I don't think they made a lot of these. Really nice shape. Glass is not cracked. Looks really pretty. Yeah. It I'm just feels good. It's the red eye variant. The red eye variant, Dad says. The red eye top of the globe. All right. All right, moving on. Still available. So number 62 is the Stucco Construction Company truck. Structo. So blue. I got this one for number 62. And then I've got the tractor for number 63 with the wagon for the 30. Let's see if I can get them both in the shot for you guys. Just tell us which number you want. I know Pam K got on late. That's Michelle right. Estrella got on late. There you go. You can always go back through, watch them, send me an email. I'd be glad to uh, throw you on the list. <clears throat> so you'll be receiving your invoice today, probably, um, unless we have a power outage, but I think we'll be good. We're going to start uh, going ahead and... Um, we're going to go ahead and uh, send you your invoice and get everything boxed up and ready to go. If you have any adjustments to your invoice, please send that within 30 minutes. Um, otherwise, there'll be separate packages, all right? So please send any and all adjustments within 30 minutes of the completion of the sale. The sale is uh, still going on for just a couple. Rapidly minutes. coming to a close. Yep, rapidly coming to a close. We still have, have the Tonka Farms truck. Yep. That light blue, pretty for, truck. For $50. For 50 there. And I've got this Structo truck for 50 No, that one is really sharp. Number 65. Like this one tilts. Ashley says she emailed you. Perfect. All right, if you're not sure if I have your contact info, please make sure you send it to hookedonpicket.com. I'd rather have too many emails than not enough and then not know where to find your info. I cannot get your info from YouTube. You have to email me. Yep. And so go ahead and just shoot me an email and say, hey, my name was... And I bought this off the store. Make sure you include your mailing address if you don't already have an account on hookedonpicking.com. You can also just go on to hookedonpicking.com and create an account. That would also be easy. Just let me know if you have a different name from your YouTube name. All right, so we have number 64 and number 65 trucks available. Number 66 is the last thing we're going to show you today. This is a Lumar red truck, $60. Um, marks, it is red, blue, and yellow. Really cool. It does actually tilt back with a little lever. Really cool, sleek design. I love the front end on that. Look at that. Beautiful. Yeah. Number 66, $60. So, and we will be sending your invoice shortly to you. 
And so as soon as you pay, you will have 72 hours in which to make the payment. You'll be able to pay with a secure credit card checkout. If you have any issues where you can't find your invoice, please let me know. Um, it may have gone to the wrong email or, you know, you might have trouble with it in spam or something like that. So always send me an email if you cannot find it. Um, and then also send me your contact info if you were a new buyer. And also a huge, huge, huge thank you for all the thumbs up and the endorsements and... Lexi is Thank super... Thank you for all the donations. Yes. So, <clears throat> I promise I will not let Paul buy her a hearse. All right? It'll we'll be We'll paint normal. it pink. It'll be beautiful. No. <laughs> okay. Anyway, thanks so much for joining us, and we'll get to packaging, and you will get your invoice shortly. And, uh, of course, remember, in the end, Jesus wins. <laughs>